Okay, everybody, welcome back to uh, Let's Play Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening DX. I can't believe I always want to say a link to the past, I guess, because it starts with Link and kind of makes sense. But, anyways, <laughs> alright, so if you're uh, playing along with the DX version, you can just walk from here. If not, then you walk to a bottle grotto, which I believe was the second dungeon of the game. So if we're gonna do that, we're gonna walk not that way. We're gonna walk up twice here. And then we're gonna walk left and up twice more. So uh, watch out for these stupid things. Alright. Get out of the way, crow. Okay. <coughs> Go up. And then from here we'll walk left again. And there's bottle grotto right there. So from here. Uh, we want to walk this way. Oop, not that way. This way. This flower. So, go ahead and, uh, equip this. we got to pick up these rocks. And we walk up here. <coughs> Oop, the wind fish sleeps long and dreamily in the egg above. When you play the eight siren instruments in front of the egg, he will awaken. This, my friend, is the only way for you to leave the island. Who? Okay. So, yeah. Basically, like I said, up these steps right here is an egg. And that's where the windfish is sleeping. So, until we get the next five, <laughs> the next five instruments, we can't do anything about that. So, next, we'll go ahead and walk down these steps. And then we'll walk right, and we'll walk right again. Ah. Okay. So we can pick this up. Walk down here. I believe I'm going the right way. At least I hope I am. And come on, the other way. So the tag tights. Is it the key? So. Down there is where our fourth dungeon will be, but we have to get around to get to it. So from here, we'll kill this Tektite and activate this warp point. So now we have three warp points, and I believe there's one more in this game somewhere. At least I think there's only one more. So, we we'll do that. And then from here, we want to walk down. We want to walk left three screens. One. To you and kill you and you and three and then oops <laughs> from here we want to walk up the ladder here and then we want to walk left two more and pick this up and then up and then from here, we want to go inside this cave here. Uh, oops. <laughs> okay. And then we kill the keys in here. And walk this way. And push this down to the hole. And then we can do this. And, oh, that was dumb. Anyways, we'll walk here. Push this one. And push this one. And go through here. So, and then from there, we go this way. And then here. Then there's a heart piece over there that we can't get to until much later in the game. So from here we can go here. And we can get these uh, rupees here. Uh, okay. And then we go here. Uh, And Pegasus, there we go. Try to find my boots. Okay, and then we go this way and down. And from here we can go here and over here. Hello, dude. Okay, anyway, we'll go inside this cave here and work our way up, killing enemies as we go. So, do these steps, open this chest, and ah, it's a soul. 
stop checking me okay and then from here we'll walk out of the cave and then we can walk this way and talk to him yep Papa just got lost just like he said now I am so famished I can't move can you give me some vittles sure this pineapple is so delicious I'm going to eat the pineapple right now bon appetit and he will very quickly eat it okay <laughs> And so he gives us a hibiscus flower, I believe is what it is. And after that, we we'll walk up here, and then we can walk. Uh, 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 nope, we gotta jump off the cliff here. And then we can walk right to uh, two more times. Keep going past this waterfall here, and then jump down. And here we go. So now, we are in level 4, Angler's Tunnel. So until next time, uh, thanks for watching, and have a good day. See you next time.